What I do, dream team. It's your boy D Neil back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with Tony and Ryan. Weird Australian sayings. Before we jump in, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Ring notification bell, give the video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. If you guys have a favorite video suggestion, you can subscribe to Patreon, drop it in the comment section or in the description section. There's a premium request link. What we got? Translating weird Australian sayings. Couldn't give a rat's ass. F me dead. Couldn't give a rat's a. F me dead. Oh, Bob's your uncle. We're not here to f spiders. <laughs> if someone says mate, what are they to you? A friend. Anything. I feel like mate. Y'all call mate for anything. It could be an enemy. It could be a friend. It could be a family member. It could be someone you haven't seen in years. It could be some a stranger, someone you just met. I feel like y'all call any and everybody mate. Could be wrong. Let's find out. Well, if they say, you know, mate, they're a mate. Mm. But if someone goes, mate, you're in trouble. Yeah, okay. What about if someone walks past and I look at you and go, oh, you're mate? Oh, they're... They're a dead shit. <laughs> it's obviously someone that's like not very good looking or Ooh. someone that both of you don't like. So you kind of say like, oh, say you and I really didn't like the same person. Yep. You go, oh, your mate. Like how embarrassing. I bet you're friends with them. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, given these examples, the word mate means? Anything you want. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, I'm going to count that in the in the win column for me. That that That's a win. That we can give your examples. The word mate means anything you want. Y'all use it for any and everything. Completely agree. I'm going to count that as a W. We're going to keep the train rolling. <laughs> when someone says, couldn't give a rat's ass, what they really mean is. You don't care. Like, you know what I'm saying? It, you give, like it says right here, they don't give a F, couldn't care less. Uh, I have zero Fs left to give. Do you. I, it does what what you are doing is not affecting me. It doesn't affect my life. I don't even. I'm not even after I see you do it or no, I've seen that you've done it. I'm not gonna think about it again because I literally do not care. Talk to me. I don't give a. F <laughs> couldn't care less. <laughs> we, Certainly couldn't care more. Are we gonna need to translate your translation? <laughs> <laughs> translate. F me dead. If, ooh, this is tougher. Translate F me dead. Uh, I'm going to go. I'm going to guess on this one because I have no idea. F me dead. Like uh, F like we're F. <laughs> like well, why Why the F is this happening? Like oh, like, like you're going through something. And, like when it rains and pours, you're going through something. something ah, F me dead, bro. F me dead. Like why is this happening? F me dead. That's what I that's what I'm thinking. Let's find out. There's no literal translation, but it's gasp. Holy moly. Gee whiz. Wow. <laughs> Could you imagine? I said that line last week and you just say, gasp. <laughs> Gee whiz. Gee whiz. <laughs> oh, the penguin's back. <laughs> Bob's your uncle. Yeah, you can say Bob's your uncle. Just saying like, hey, something is simple. You know what I'm saying? How you tie your shoes? Oh, you do the loop-de-loop, -loop, pull, and Bob's your uncle. <laughs> How do you screw this in? Oh, you get the Phillips screwdriver, put it right here, turn right, and Bob's your uncle. <laughs> How do you make this food? Oh, you get the pots and pans, you boil the water, put the noodles in, and Bob's your uncle. <laughs> that, that's how I take it. <laughs> oh, the penguin's back. <laughs> Bob's your uncle. Oh, all good. Sorted. Like... Bob's your uncle. If you do that, everything will be right as rain. <laughs> right as rain. I'm not here Maybe to fuck spiders. Wrong. Maybe I was wrong. I'm not here to have spiders. Like, know what I'm saying? Like, like we came here to do something. Let's get it done. You feel me? We're not we're not here to F spiders. Hey, we're we're chatting around. Hey, what are we supposed to Hey, what are we supposed to be doing? Well, we're not here to F spiders. Let's get to work. We're not supposed to just be sitting here chit chatting. What do you say? Mucking around, playing around. No, we're, we're here to get the job done. 
I'm not here to muck around. I'm, I'm here, here to, for a reason. I'm here exactly. to get the job done. Um, yeah. If you're at the pub and someone said, oh, do you want a beer, mate? You'd go, oh, not here to f- spiders. Like, of course there I want a beer. Yeah. Like, is we, the Pope a Catholic? It's that kind of thing. If right? we turned up to do this podcast and we're like, oh, should we get started? You go, oh, I'm not here to f- spiders. Exactly, yeah. Okay. Taxi! What does taxi mean in Australia? Um, so if mm. somebody... Dro- I have no idea what taxi means. This this one is uh, it's new. This is a new Actually, one. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Taxi. What does taxi mean in Australia? Um. So if somebody drops a, a glass or a plate or anything or falls over or something, most commonly if you drop a beer glass in a pub, every single fucking person in the pub will go taxi. No wackers is the next one. Ta- taxi. Whatever, that's just something that you say, but it doesn't like mean anything. The taxi to let you know that hey, someone dropped a beer glass or like try to embarrass that person. I don't know. I don't know. What is no worries? Hakuna Matata. You feel me? Person in the pub will go taxi. No wackers is the next one. <laughs> um, I hate it when people say no wackers. It really f***s me off. Um, but it means no worries for the rest of your day. Hakuna Matata. <laughs> me and her, same way, we No Hakuna Matata. No worries. Now, this is actually very common and might seem overly simple. Uh-huh. But it's actually one that throws people Give from the US. Me. Give it to me. How you going? How you going? How you going? <laughs> I was just like, yeah, like, like, how are you doing? How are you? But, but it's not really like... I'm not really like asking you like how are you doing, how are you going. Uh, I don't really want to know the the expected response to this. Kind of like in America, we say, "What's up? How, how are you? How you been? Oh, I've been good. How you doing today? I'm good. You good? Kind of like that. You don't expect it. How you going? Ah oh, man, things have just been uh, they've been really crappy. I just did this. I lost the house. Uh, the wife left. We don't really want to uh, to dive into your situation. How you going? It's a greeting. It's a greeting. Is it? Like, I'm going into the city. How are you going? Oh, by the train. Oh. How are you going? Oh, I'm walking. But for us, how are you going actually How's means... How's it going? Like, means, how is it yeah. going with you? How yeah. are you? Yeah. So, yeah. how are you going? How like, are how's you? how's your life going? Is kind of... Because I remember saying, how are you going? And they're like, I, I don't know yet. <laughs> it's like, what? Like, I remember saying, how you going? They said, I don't know yet. <laughs> Oh, we'll, we'll just Where drive. Where did they think you were going? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, why are they asking me? Like, I just met how you. How are your finances going? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what does it mean when an Australian says, yeah, nah? No, it means no. And when an Australian says, nah, yeah, it means yeah. And what does it mean when an Australian says, nah, yeah? So if you said to me, I love meat pies, and I went, yeah, nah, it's... Yeah, I hear what you're saying, but nah, I don't agree. Interesting. But if you said, oh, I love meat pies, and I went, nah, yeah, that means, like, nah, get f***ed, it's so good. (laughs) Yeah, I agree. (laughs) I love these two. We definitely got to do some more of their content. These two are absolutely hilarious. And I want more. They, they should have made this a 10-minute video. Uh, but that's all we got for this one. I wanted to start doing some original Australian content. But I've never been to Australia before. So are there any ideas that you guys have that I could possibly do? Any Anything I could look up and maybe do? But uh, y'all let me know in the comment section. That's all we got for this one. You guys got a favorite video suggestion? You can subscribe to Patreon and drop it in the comment section. Or... In the description section, there's a premium request link. It's your boy, d Out.